So we got the aircraft remover because I got like I got like black paint in here. It's still not coming off like these little bits and up here. Obviously, I'm just gonna smear it on here. Uh, it's supposed to be pretty much like I guess lacquer thinner on roids. It's like three times the cost of lacquer thinner, and I use lacquer on here and a pressure washer, and it's still left a bunch of bunch of crap on here like that. So we're gonna go ahead and do that, and obviously we're gonna open the door so we don't suffocate or get high or whatever happens. Damn. I'll let that sit down there for like 20, 30 minutes. We're gonna remove the bumper and gonna measure and cut. Make sure you guys are ventilating the garage because this it's enough to give you asthma. It's pretty pretty strong. Don't inhale it. Put the tins back. Oops. All right, bumpers off. Yay! I gotta measure and then uh, cut the diff cut my bumper up for the diffuser. Mint OEM bumper. Let's go. All right, so I took the measurement of this, and which was uh, forty three. Seven eighths, I believe, and I divided it by two, which was 21 15 16, which is exactly to these center holes right here. I took the measurement from the lip right here where the trunk sits, measured that, divided that by two, and that was at 21 and a half, I think, or 20 and a half to the center line. But I also make sure made sure it lined up with the center, the center hole for your uh, screw. I'm gonna put some more tape on here, and we're gonna put this diffuser on, or cut holes. I think the paint started to come up. I don't know. Kind of drying. So I'm going to probably rinse this off first. If you do yourself a favor and go to the dollar store and get one of these. These flexible tape measure things. So anyway, yeah, I got my end of that, which is right here. I'm using this bumper as a mock-up. That's the bumper it came off of. I'm going to throw this diffuser on here and trace. Cut it out and we'll be done. God, this paint. Apparently I needed a second coat. It's like the worst paint. Flakes really easy when you buy it. But the rest of it won't come off easy, so you gotta use the aircraft stripper. Basically it looks like shit from the factory. It is one of the cooler looking diffusers though. Kind of I'm a big pretty big fan of like the style, so. Alright, so we got our holes traced. Um it's a little, a little messy with these uh sharpened lines, but I got them on both sides. Um, never installed one of these. I said, screw it. I'm not going to even look it up on YouTube. I'm just use my brain. I've done construction, carpentry, and all that. I can read a tape measure. Um, yeah. If you guys want to how to, I'm sorry. I'm too busy trying to get this done so I can go gap some fools. Honestly, they're coming half bad. You know, luckily, uh, not perfect, but the diffuser will cover all this when I put the diffuser on. It's nice and shiny for you guys, so you guys have something to look at when I'm freaking putting Costco lights on your ass. All done. Don't know what to say, but I don't know, it was a freaking pain in the ass to put on. It's pissing me off, but there it is. I never want to do this again. We 
tell you the Speedway was stubborn. It's 549 here at Chevron, the Tecron. <laughs> it's cheaper here than the Speedway. They're just being stubborn. Yeah. It's the good shit here. <laughs> It's also cheap, regular cheaper than 519 here.
so I'm home now. No races in. It's kind of a problem with like a lot of, a lot of traffic and not very many cars on the road like that want to race. But like I know a lot of traffic I said, but there's also like opportunities to get races in. I guess maybe I'm just retarded. Just got home. I'm just gonna throw uh, pizza in the oven because it's late and it's Sunday. And I gotta work tomorrow. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Now I gotta pull my car in the garage. And that's it. I'm doing a lot of spinning. Sorry, dizzy. I'm gonna try to get some more races in. Keep trying for you guys. Well, I also want to race. I haven't raced anyone in a really long time. So yeah, hopefully sometime this week. So bye. Later. Subscribe.